Good morning, everybody. Tater here. I'm in uh, Gambier Station, central Jakarta. Uh, here at the train station, about to head on down to Surabaya, I believe you say it. Anyway, I've booked a luxury train, sleeper, sleeper train for this nice trip. Uh, roughly 90 US dollars for that bad boy, so we're gonna go check it out. Now, this is early in the morning, so I guess it'll be more of like a mid afternoon nap train instead of an overnight one, but hey, you know, when you're riding in style, you gotta do it right. So, anyway, I'm gonna go grab my ticket. I did purchase it online, so I just got to go over to the little boarding pass uh, printer and uh, get that thing printed out. So, anyway, let's get going, huh? Look at that. It's even American proof, this machine that they have. All right. So I guess now we're going to go through this little security checkpoint, and then uh, we will be on our way to our nice train. <laughs> All good? That's what here. Yeah, perfect. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you kindly, sir. All right, so we are looking for Lux 1B. Argo and Grek Luxury Sleeper. As you can see, they do check you for, you know, vaccination, passport, and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, no sneaking through on the train. Alright, so it looks like this is going to be our train here, coming 820, Argo Bromo. Now my ticket doesn't say Bromo, but I know that Bromo is that volcano down there, so I'm guessing we're heading in the right direction. I thought that was gonna be the train. I was like, that would be pretty awesome, man. Just the, the one, the one link. Anyway, all right, so as you can see up here, this is the top of Gambier Station. Gambier, that's, that's the white way to say it, okay? That's all I know. But yeah, very busy. As you can see, that escalator is, uh, they're, they're getting their money's worth on that one, okay? There's a lot of people here queuing in early in the morning. It's about uh, 8 a.m. right now, so. And it's gonna be, ooh, yeah, eight hours, eight hours to Surubaya, the old promo. chariot has arrived. I did get a peek at the seats, so I know where I'm headed, somehow. It's a miracle. Hi there. Am I in the right direction here? Yeah. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. One B, I believe I'm one B here. They gave me the first seat. How could they? All right, looking pretty good actually. Comfy looking seat. I think this is like a blanket or something. Fantastic. Some type of controls going on here. We'll figure those out here in a second. Hey now, I can get down with this, okay? Look at this. Complimentary, huh? Beautiful. Looks like we also have a blindfold. 
if you're into that type of thing. I don't know if that's wide enough for my head, but we'll figure it out. Looks like we're off already. Alright, so we are steadily moving along here. I'm going to check out all the other stuff around my seat here. Like I said, you have your fancy screen, 12 inches. Uh, honestly, probably... here and I am assuming that this is for your shoes because um, I think here you know you don't put your uh, you know, shoes up on furniture things like that anyway as you can see there is plenty of leg room plenty I mean we got at least another foot let's check out the seat action here I believe we have some buttons I'm always a fan of the buttons anyway okay I think we're is this the recline oh yes yes it is all right takes a while. Bear with me. Now that, that goes all the way down basically. I mean I'm almost flat. I would say you know 10 degrees off of flat. This is actually, I like this. This is comfortable. Like I'm normally not someone who can sleep on uh, transportation or anything like that, like a plane is impossible, but this, I definitely could fall asleep, especially with some, you know, earbuds in or something. I would be conked out. All right, and of course you have light switch here. I'm assuming it's just, oh, there, that one right there, very bright. Anyway, so if you wanna, you know, read a book or something. Now, obviously you probably wanna take this thing, you know, overnight. So, you know, you don't have to book a hotel and you can save some money that way. But, you know, I, I don't do things uh, in a smart way. So here we are. Thankfully, they have an international charging port. Always good, always good. And then we have, uh, I'm assuming, a tray. Oh, it's actually pretty sturdy. It's not, uh, I, I probably could get my laptop on that if I tried. But, uh, and then here, this little container, I'm assuming for, you know, snack storage. As you can see, I have acquired some other things that I, snuck on here. I didn't tell you guys about it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, and then of course, the vanity mirror. How are we looking, guys? Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Now, it looks like they do actually have Wi-Fi on here. Fantastic. I have connected. Let's see what type of speeds we got in here. You know, it's not the you know, craziest, fastest internet I've ever seen, but, you know, complimentary Wi-Fi. Not bad. I'm sure, you know, probably fine for Netflix or something like that, so that's good. No idea what this button does it's just a person there's just a person and a power button i'm kind of afraid to press it honestly i have no idea what's going to happen no. No, i've never actually used the blindfold in this scenario so we'll see what do you guys think huh? about to be sleeping beauty here It works, okay? Maybe 
keep that into consideration for the front. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if it's better in the back. I don't want to go like creep along back there and start, you know, filming around. I don't want to do that. So. Uh, it's about uh, 
about two o'clock here, so it's been almost six hours already. Uh, I had such a feeling breakfast, I haven't been full, but we're about to bust into this little snack case. Uh, I did want to show you guys where we're at. We're somewhere between these two fine cities. I'm going with Cimarong and Suricarta, I guess, officially. But it uh, shouldn't be too much longer now, and we should be uh, heading to uh, Suru Bay, uh, apparently is how you say it, something like that. Better pronunciation than the first one. Anyway, let's bust in to our little snack case here and check out our luxury snack box. Suru Bea, um, East Java. So anyway, 
I did, I did manage actually, guys. I think I fell asleep for like half an hour there, you know, so mission accomplished on my <laughs> sleeper train. But uh, no, I just can't sleep during the day, okay? Naps are hard for me, but uh, we managed we managed some shut eye, so not so horrible. Anyway. I'm just hanging out. I got my flipping towel, you know. Other than that, really not much to uh, not much to report in on. Like I said, very comfortable. Uh, you know, I haven't even felt the need to get up and like stretch or anything. So we're chilling. I probably should have, you know, DVT and all that fun stuff. But uh, uh, the only thing I could really comment on is, uh, you know, the people who are, you know, working on the train and going back and forth. Uh, first off, just amazing. Everybody's awesome, very friendly, very helpful. Uh, they come through and they're, you know, picking up trash and stuff like that. And obviously bringing you hot towels and, you know, breakfast early and stuff like that. But yeah, like I said, everyone very friendly, very professional. Hello. Can you take your yeah, sure. Go for it. Yeah, go for it. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much. Speak of the devil. There you have it, right there. That's been a fantastic journey so far. Um, fun, fun little trip. But we are, again, I can feel it coming, you know. So I think uh, for the most part, we're on schedule. It's, uh, we're supposed to arrive at 4.30. It's currently 4.33. It looks like we're, you know, tuning down here. So I imagine it will be rolling up any moment now, but I've got my, oh, uh, I probably should have put that back up there anyway. My bags and stuff all ready to go. And we're gonna be hitting the road here shortly. And I didn't actually book a hotel. I probably should have done that, but you know, we're gonna go find one, so. All right, we're out of here. Make sure I didn't forget anything. Thank you. Kaluar. Okay. Very busy. Very busy here at 4 p.m. But uh, anyway, first things first, everybody. I'll be right back. Oh, yeah. Gonna have to part the seas for this one. What's up, boss? No car, no thank you. Okay, okay. Just get me to the street, brother. Ah! All right. No thank you, sir. No thank you. Hello, brother. Excuse me. Okay. We are on our way, everybody. You know, I'm feeling... Normally after about eight hours of travel, I just kind of want to die. But you know, after that, not so bad. We're on it. Okay. Busy, busy street. All right. I think the, I think the idea here is we just hit up a Goda and we find a hotel and then we go from there, yeah? All right, sorry about that. I'm actually in my hotel room already. Um, apparently my SIM card uh, does not work well here in the, uh, in this particular city. Worked fine in Jakarta, but, uh, not so hot, so I had to steal some Starbucks Wi-Fi to book a hotel, but you know, no biggie. Anyway, I am here now. This is, um, oh man, I don't, I can't remember what it's called. The Great Dipinagoro. Dipinagoro? I don't know, one of those. Anyway, uh, this was a uh, hotel room. Well, this is the hotel room. And this is, I believe, it was like $20 after taxes and fees. So, you know, kind of on the budget side, but not all the way on the super budget. But, you know, anyway, this is what it looks like. Looks like a, looks like a hotel room, okay? Nice shower there for you, huh? Okay, so, I mean, that's basically it. I mean, this looks, this looks like a nice hotel, but uh, what a day already. I forgot how, uh, how quickly it gets dark here. I mean, it's only 6 p.m. Anyway. That's it for me, everybody. Thank you guys so much. I do appreciate you. If you make it this far in the video, you're like a, I don't even know, a champion of the people, truly. I appreciate you guys. Uh, and thank you so much. And I'm gonna go get my brain right, because as you can tell, I'm kind of like malfunctioning mentally. So uh, on to more stuff. Apparently I'm going to flipping Mordor or something. Who knows? Anyway, see ya.